Hi everyone, welcome to another housing episode of our Inside CSUCI Admissions Network, or otherwise known as ICANN. Throughout this series, I share tips and tricks for living on and off campus. So for this episode today, I will be going through and explaining the different meal plans that are offered, as well as what flex cash is and how you can use it. All residents on campus housing must be enrolled in a meal plan. According to exactly which village a resident resides in, there are going to be different meal plans available. Um, all meal plans are loaded onto a student's ID card where they will swipe at the Islands View Cafe. As for Flex Cash, on the other hand, is loaded again onto a student's ID card as well, but can be used at the different eateries on campus. For instance, one of my personal favorites is Pizza Pie or Pizza 3.14 located in Town Center. Um, but you could even use your Flex Cash at the C store to buy a Scantron. The only location where Flex Cash will not be used is the Town Center bookstore. So let's start off with the different meal plans that are offered. Let's first look at the Santa Rosa Residence Hall, or otherwise known as the Freshman Dorms, and then the Santa Cruz Residence Hall as well, where most sophomores and upperclassmen reside. So students there have three different meal plans to choose from, from Basic 160, Enhanced 224, and Premier 304. The main difference between these plans is obviously going to be the number of swipes and flux cash a student will have for the semester. So starting with basic 160, students will have a total of 160 swipes for the semester, as well as $300 worth of flex cash. So on average, that amounts to about 10 meals per week. So although this may seem like really low, students may also want to factor in if they plan to stay most weekends, go home or like just even eat out. So for me personally, I had the basic 160 plan my freshman year, and I still had about 50 swipes left over at the end of the semester um, so no need to worry it's totally normal but if you are looking for more swipes but less flex cash the enhanced 224 meal plan might be for you again this plan includes more swipes at Islands View Cafe but only about $200 worth of flex cash to be used at the eateries on campus um, Next up is going to be the Premier 304. Here there are a total of 304 swiped for the semester with only $50 flex cash. On average, that amounts to about 19 meals per week. So um, overall, all of these different meal plans come with different prices. So be sure to view the housing website to view the total amount and what is right for you. Next, we have the Anacapa Village. So most of these residence halls are similar to apartments where they have full-size kitchens in their residence hall. Um, with that, there are going to be different meal plans available for residents residing in Anacapa. Here are the different meal plans reflect the number of swipes a student will have. So the basic 60 meal plan has a total of 60 swipes at Islands View Cafe with only $125 worth of flex cash. And then the next one up after that is going to be the enhanced 75 with 75 swipes and still only $125 worth of flex cash. And lastly, the Premier 90 meal plan has again 90 swipes with, you guessed it, $125 worth of flex cash. So as you can see with the number of swipes available, that amounts to less than five meals a week where you will be at the Islands View Cafe. Last but not least, we have Town Center. Again, most of the residence halls in Town Center are like apartments where you'll have full access to your own kitchen to cook most of your meals. But again, if you ever want the night off from cooking or craving some food down at Islands View Cafe, there is gonna be only one meal plan available for the residents in Town Center. The basic 30 meal plan provides residents with a total of 30 meals for the semester at Islands View Cafe with only about $390 worth of flex cash. So as you can see, this plan will have you down at the Islands Cafe a lot less, um, but definitely have you at most of the eateries on campus a lot more. 
So those are going to be all of the meal plans that housing is going to offer, but they are subject to change. But just to let you all know, Meals at the Islands U Cafe, where students will swipe their ID card, will expire at the end of each semester. So however, Flex Cash, on the other hand, will be rolled over to the next semester. For instance, my freshman year, again, I had a total of about 50 swipes left over um, my first semester, and sadly those expired. And I I couldn't use them for the next semester, but I did have about $200 worth of flex cash that I was able to roll over to the spring semester. And then at the end of the spring semester, those ended up expiring. Also, if students at any time feel like they want to increase their meal plan, they can. So anytime during the semester, however, if they're going to want to decrease their meal plan and go for um, go from the enhanced meal plan to maybe the basic plan, um, there is going to be a deadline to switch that. If you have any questions about the different meal plans, definitely feel free to visit their housing website at go.csuci.edu housing. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.